Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Dale and this is another episode of Jungle Heat. I'm posting a Jungle Heat video and I'm posting a single player Jungle Heat video today at the same day. I just realized that. Um, but, um, is this the right, is this the right account? Yeah, it is. Alright, just wanted to make sure it wasn't on a different account for some reason because I have a couple other accounts that I work on at the same time as this one. Um, but I haven't really been working on my level 7 base that much because I have this one, my level 6 command center, which is the one where I don't do any attacking. Um... I don't do any attack in that one, so I can see if I can catch up or not. And then level 7 one, I haven't been working on that much, because I don't want to work on too many bases. Because um, that's just a lot, of, a lot of time on hand. That's just too much time. But anyways, um, my shield finally ran out. It's been 11, like 10 days or 11 days, so my shield finally ran out. And I basically used all the gold that I had to upgrade this flamethrower level 6 and this flamethrower level 6. That was $6 million right there. Um, so I basically used six million dollars that I got from that to upgrade those two guys, and that's pretty much all I did with the gold. And then the oil, I was researching some guys. I think I got my hornets up to level five, yeah. And then that's pretty much it that I did with the oil. Uh, I think I upgraded. No, I didn't even upgrade my barracks level ten. That's what I wanted to do. Why didn't I upgrade those? Oh, you know what? I was I was almost there. That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to upgrade the barracks level 10, and then the workshop came out, and the comm center came out, and I built those, and I got rid of, like, 1 million oil, and then I actually upgraded, um, I actually researched this to level 2, which cost a million oil as well, so that basically is what happened to all my oil, and I meant to save up for the barracks level 10, but I accidentally... I must have. I wasn't thinking at the time, and I just researched that stuff instead. So that kind of sucks. I didn't want to do that, but I did it anyways. But I guess that's all right, because um, I don't really need them yet. I don't really need the Iron Storm yet until I get a little further. Um, I probably will need him by this area right here. And if you didn't see my last video, Castle Clash video, if you didn't see my Castle Clash video, I finally got a new HDMI cable. If you see my other episodes where the signal goes out all the time and stuff. Um, yeah, I finally got a new one, and I basically have been recording without the keyboard because without the keyboard, it doesn't go out as much. The signal won't move around, or the HDMI cable won't move around because, yeah, well, I'm, I have it on a flat surface. But now I can sit on, I can just sit it on my lap and just sit here and do this at the same time. And if the HDMI moves around, it won't go out, and I can now finally use my keyboard. So if I want to show you guys where I'm putting something, um, then I can use the keyboard to show you guys that. So that's nice, but I'm probably not really going to need... Um, Iron Storm until I get to this area. I'm um, not too sure what these look like, but I, I still gotta pass these two first before I move on. Um, but I'm basically posting the Panathian video after this video um, and later today. But I want to see what this one looks like real quick. Um, okay. I'm trying to think, we could use Hornets for this one, or yeah, Hornets and. So I basically put a whole bunch of hornets on this side and just go crazy. Just put them along this whole entire row, like 20 of them, maybe 25, and just put them all right here. And they'll all just go down this row because there's only, what, a few, few, yeah, there's like one, two, there's four flame, the floor, flame towers, and two wash towers. So that's not that bad. But this side, though, probably have to use, like, um flamethrower or pyros pyros on this side hornets on that side maybe that could work or maybe we can do gunners gunners and bombers on this side we can do a bunch of bomb uh, gunners and then put some bombers um here too but the only thing is that death ray is in the middle so and that's the upgraded death ray too but i don't know what level that is pretty, probably level three death ray right there so that kind of sucks but they're not level eight towers so that's good but i don't know we'll figure that out when I get there. So first I gotta do these other, I first gotta do these other two boss battles and then we can do that but I'm still trying to pass Death Star's Cathedral and I gotta get all the way to Diamond Cathedral. I mean we gotta get we gotta get there. We got to, got to get there and then we can finally we're almost done we're almost done guys we're almost done. Hopefully I can pass it soon. But yeah so anyways um besides that I, I don't know there's not really much else I did while I was doing that, I didn't do any attacking. I actually did an attack yesterday, and I had I meant I don't know I was 
I mean, to train troops, but I never do. Um, but it didn't go out, it didn't turn out so well. I think I attacked a level 9 base instead of a level 7 or 8 base. Yeah, so it was level 9 base. And, um, yeah, there were some guys in the in the clan castle, so I had to put all my gunners down and I put a few flame or pyros down too because a lot of those guys were dying really fast. Um, but I basically put them down and I put too many pyros down too. I put um, one too many down. I think that's one of the reasons I lost, but. Then I put the gunners and stuff over here, and I put too many powers down one area because the mortar takes them out too fast. I think, I think that's what happened, but. But yeah, and then, and then these traps, see, there are traps in the all over the place. But this is where I think they all pretty much die. They had a bunch of um, pyros in the middle with the gunners, but the gunners, or the pyros, were dying a lot faster than I wanted them to. And then they all just died fast. So. And he's got level 8 walls, too. That's the other thing. I don't know why I did this with the level 8 walls. Not smart, Dale. And then this guy's jumping over the walls and stuff. I didn't know he did that. Um, so yeah, I lost that when I only got 44%. I got some, I did still get some gold there. You can see at the end, I was hitting that gold storage. So I was able to get a little bit of gold, but not that much, not that much. Um, so yeah, so anyways, that's all I've been really doing. Um, I wanted to do an attack for you guys. I don't know why I didn't have troops trained, because now I can't really do anything else. Um... I'm pretty sure there's something else to upgrade it to. I don't know. What else did I do? But yeah, so anyways, um, I didn't go through the... Uh, one thing I didn't go through is the these actual, what they actually do. Because when I was... The last video, these were actually um, upgrading right now. Or they were still being built. So they weren't done building it. And I wasn't able to show you guys what each of these do. But this is pretty much like a missile. And I'm sure you guys already know this by now. Because you guys probably have these built. But if you don't have them built yet. Because you're not that high of a level. This is what they do. Um, the airstrike is used to when attacking an enemy base to deal additional damage in the small area. So you just basically put them on top of a tower, and it'll do a little bit of damage. It gets, it get rid. I mean, I was doing. I use these on the single player missions, and I put them on the level eleven watchtower, and it got pretty much most of the health gone. I think it had like one fourth of its health left. Um, so it, it's not that bad of a missile. I mean, if you upgrade it, it'll probably do a lot better too. But, um. And that's it was pretty good. And then the espionage, um, used um, when you use them clan headquarters to play is what troops are inside. Um, after being upgraded in the workshop, can reveal enemy traps. Um, so that's good. So I can put it down in the area or put it on top of the clan castle and then see if there's troops in there. So I don't have to worry about putting gunners down or not. So that kind of helps out. And then this one is a uh, med pack, which is just reviving your ally troops in a small area. Which I need to, but I need to upgrade the con center first, which is two million dollars. Two million oil. Two million dollars. Two million dollars, even though it's called oil. Yes, so and um yeah, so that's not gonna be upgraded for a while. Um I might actually that might be the next thing I do with the upgrade because Iron Storm, I don't really need the Iron Storm exactly quite yet. Um, at least until I get to uh let's say tree war. Even maybe if we get by even if we get to the black top of the cathedral, maybe that's when I'll try to train Iron Storm and then use him, use him in that one. But I don't know what it looks like yet. I haven't gotten there, but we'll get there. Um, so I'll keep training troops. Actually, I'll probably do that right now. Try to figure out what troops I know might want to use. Because I've been using pyros and hornets. That's what I've been trying to do for this one. Is pyros and hornets, but it's not been working out because these watchtowers in the middle are what gets me. Because these watchtowers in the middle take out all my hornets. That's what the problem is. So, trying to figure it out still. Um, I tried to use all pyros, I think, and that didn't work. Um, all hornets could work, maybe. Yeah, I wonder if that would... Uh, I don't know. No, all hornets probably wouldn't work if that sounds... It's kind of stupid. Because I could do a med guy, and um, yeah, I could do that. I could use a healer, and then put a bunch of gunners down, and have the healer use or heal the gunners, possibly. Yeah, I could try that. I could try that and see what happens. Actually, let's do that. See what happens if I try that. Then we can train. So we got a healer. We'll train a couple of those. Just have them. So we'll do a healer. Uh, we gotta get some, we gotta get a couple pyros to get rid of the, uh, flame, or the watchtowers. 
And we'll basically I need like four on each side though, don't I? Yeah, do so. We'll do four, eight, twelve, sixteen. So it's ten, and then six, and then we'll do gunners. Oops. And then we'll see how that goes. And then we'll do a bomber. Okay, we'll see how that goes. We'll get rid of those Jericho's first, and then we'll put the gunners down with healer. And then that way, the healer will heal them all as they're going through. But, I don't know, we'll see what happens when that happens. But that won't be for you know, two hours, so we'll try that in a couple hours and see what happens. Um... But yeah, so pretty much besides that, that's pretty much it. Um, I want to I want to start upgrading some, or I want to start um, um, what was I gonna say? I want to start um, uh, what is the word I'm looking for? Promoting. There we go. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. Promoting some of you guys in the guild, um, that have been donating a lot and stuff, and that are pretty much active all the time. Unlike me, where I'm not that as much, it's not as active as I would like to be, anyways. Um, but some of the guys like Phase, Apex. Um, I doubt you're Apex from Phase Clan, anyways. Um, are you just a fan of Apex, Phase Apex, or whatever? Because I know, I know, I've heard of him, but Spooky Star has been donating a lot, and there's some else too. Crew, I guess. Um, I don't know. But yeah, so anyways, I'll look through this and then see if anybody, or if you want to be up, um, if you actually want to get promoted in your clan, let me know, um, and I'll look at your stats and stuff and see if you're, if you really would be okay to be an upgrade, but I, um, well, I promoted some guys in Clash of Clans and they've been working out pretty well, so, um, I'll think about it in here, so if you guys want to be promoted, let me know in the comments and I'll, uh, figure that out. So, but anyways, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, sorry I didn't have any troops trained. I wanted to do an attack for you guys, but um, I guess that won't work. But I'll, I'll train these guys, try to do this Death Star Cathedral, and then we're going to do this other boss battle. Let me see what this looks like anyway. Oh my gosh. Oh no, 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 no. I just put two of my gunners down. Wow. Whoopsies. Alright, um, so the Jericho is in the middle, so that's not good. Comps. <laughs> Look at that comps here. And that's in the middle. Um, okay. Um, I was gonna say pyros could work. I think I tried to do this with pyros, but. Hmm. I don't know. I'll look at it again. I'll look at it more closely after the video. Try to figure out. And I gotta train two more. I gotta train two more guys now, because I freaking. There we go. Okay. Um, yeah, so anyways, that's pretty much it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in the next video. So, anyways, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Yeah. My name is Dale, and peace out.